Become a member of my channel to vote on my next video, along with other perks. Link in the description. What's up Thomas Nerds, it's Trackmaster Tomy. Today I have a very special set that I've been wanting for a long time. We're going to be looking at the Playrail Thomas and Freight Car set. Thomas and Freight Car set is a Playrail and Tomica World set released on May 17, 2001. This set includes 31 pieces including the exclusive Annoyed Face Thomas, Scruffy, Red, Green and Brown Troublesome Trucks, three flatbeds, the exclusive troublesome tanker, a red express coach, the breakdown train, eight loads for the trucks including trees, barrels, fish and fruit, Terrence, Trevor, Caroline, a bunch of blue track including a three-way switch and four buffers. This set contains the first release of Thomas with a white running board and red stripes. Let's look at the engines and rolling stock first. This set includes one engine and 11 pieces of rolling stock. Let's go through them. Annoyed Face Thomas is a variant exclusive to the set. He is super cool. As stated before, this was the first instance they gave Thomas red stripes and a white running board, and it looks amazing. His face is super accurate and the extra detail makes it look exceptional. I'm so glad that they included an exclusive face variant in this set. I also really like the face they chose to put on him. It was a great choice to make in toy form. There are four troublesome trucks included in the set. A brown one, a green one, a red one, and scruffy. I really like the variety of trucks we get in this set. They all have unique colors and different faces. The brown truck has a sad face, the red truck has a laughing face, the green truck has an angry face, and scruffy has his regular Tommy face. I'm missing some of the loads they carry. I only have one of the barrels and trees and both of the fish crates. I'm missing the fruit crates and one of the barrels and trees, which kind of sucks, but at least I have the trucks. The version of Scruffy included in the set is the brown rebuilt version of him after he was torn apart by Oliver, which is super cool. This was an exclusive to the set until he was re-released in the Tommy Thomas Ultimate set. Playroll really put a lot of effort into this set. This set includes three green flatbeds which hold Trevor, Terrence, and Caroline. Huh? Sadly, I'm missing Caroline. It's kind of weird how she was missing in both this set and the ultimate set that I got. The flat bits are pretty standard, but that isn't a bad thing. These are going to be great to have more interesting rolling stock consists in my remakes and other videos. I also really like the inclusion of road vehicles. They add variety and look super cool, even if they aren't the most accurate. Here is another exclusive item this set has to offer. It's the Troublesome Tanker. From the side it may look like a boring white tanker, but when you look at it from the front you see why this item is so special. This set contains the only instance where a tanker has a face. Uh, until recently. The face they use is the smiling narrow gauge truck face and it looks awesome. It's a simple addition, but looks amazing. This will definitely add some spice to the trains my engines pull. I really like this one. Here is the breakdown train. The first thing I noticed when I got this is that it's a way different color to my Hit Toys version that came with Mavis. This one is a darker pine green, whereas my Hit Toys version is a more bright pear color. This is also a nice inclusion. I think Playrail did a really good job with the breakdown train because you can move the hook, crane arm, and it swivels 360 degrees. This is a classic piece of Tommy merchandise, and I'm glad it was included. That's all of the engines and rolling stock, now let's look at the set itself. This set has a pretty simple stadium shaped track layout with two sidings, one on the outside and one on the inside. The one on the outside really isn't a siding, just another way to connect other sets to it. But the one on the inside is great. The siding on the inside has a three way switch so you can fit all of the rolling stock except for two wagons for Thomas to pull. The only thing I'm missing from the set are the three orange buffers, which isn't a big deal. This is a very good design, simple but effective. Now I'll give my final thoughts. Overall, I love the Thomas and Freight Car set. It has so many unique and exclusive items that are so cool to finally own. I've been searching for the set for a long time, and it's amazing that I own it now. Looking at the set compared to the recent stuff playroll has been putting out, it really shows their decline in quality over the years. My favorite parts of this set were the Annoyed Thomas, Troublesome Tanker, and the variety of rolling stock. I don't have a least favorite part. I would definitely recommend this set. It's a classic and one of the best Thomas sets of all time from any merchandise range. I would give Thomas and Freight Car set a 10 out of 10. Now let's give Annoyed Thomas a run around the layout.